Often the ship you start with isn't the ship you need after a few jumps once you grow into it. Alpha 15 introduced the ability to change your ship's canvas size before deploying ships after jumping. Let's talk about how to do that and some of the considerations surrounding it. First, we need to cover the concept of ship points. Your fleet is allotted a maximum of 8 ship points and each tile takes up one ship point. A tile in this case is an 26 by 26 grid, but on the macro level we'll call this a 1 by 1 canvas. That means you could have a fleet consisting of 8 1 by 1 ships, a fleet with a 2 by 3 ship and a 1 by 2 ship, or any number of other combinations that add up to 8. Let's go into a hypothetical. Let's say you have a fleet consisting of four ships, a 3x1, a 2x1, and two 1x1 one one ships. I'm no longer producing enough food to feed my crew of 28, and I don't have any more room for grow beds on my 2x1 Bonnie ship. I need to expand it from 2x1 to 3x1. With my current fleet configuration, I'm using 7 out of 8 ship points. So expanding the 2x1 to a 3x1, I'll be using all 8 of my ship points. No more room to grow. Now that we've laid out what ship points are and how it pertains to your fleet, let's change the ship's canvas size. Fire up your ship's hyperdrives and jump out of the sector and click jump. Navigate to a new sector and drop in. On the ship deployment screen, left click and drag the ship you want to modify down to the canvas box here. The small boxes here show what size configurations you can convert it to based off the ship's current hull shape. A 1x1 ship can grow into any size canvas, while a 2x1 canvas may not be able to shrink to a 1x1 or convert to a 1x2. You cannot convert it to that canvas size without removing the hull to conform it to that limit. Clicking the left and right arrows here, will change it to the next valid canvas shape. You can also shift your hull within the current canvas. This is done by clicking the four arrows here. Often, if you take on a claimable derelict, you'll have to shift it around in its canvas to optimize space and hyperdrive or airlock placement. I hope this helped clear up how, why, and when to change a ship's canvas size or move it around within its existing canvas. Stay tuned for more tutorials every Tuesday and if you have questions, Fire them off in the comments down below or head over to the official Bug Bite Discord in the description below. Take it easy, and I'll catch you in the next one. Buh bye bye